All right, what's up, everybody? It's Jeff Norris back again. Uh, it's Friday night, about 9.25, uh, March 21st. And I just want to make a little video about uh, a channel that I've subscribed to probably in the past two or three years. Really good channel. It's uh, the Joe Rogan Experience. A um, lot of in-depth conversation. A lot of intelligent, thought-provoking uh, conversations. And uh, I just really enjoy the channel. It's refreshing to hear people uh, s speak truthfully about different things. Uh, it also has a, a, f <laughs> a really funny side to it. I mean, I heard some funny-ass stories on that, on that, on that channel. Um, when b Reels on, there's always some funny shit going on. Uh, a lot of the comedians he has on there. Uh, but they're also very intelligent people. I mean, when when you're writing your own jokes, however many days a week these guys are going up on stage and, and performing, um, you expand your mind. And that's what this channel does for people. If you want to subscribe to a channel that provokes your thoughts, and, and it doesn't change my views on the world. I don't always agree with everything they, they agree with. And that's the beauty of it, is that I can respect their opinion because they present they present their opinions in an intelligent way. So I can hear what they're saying and still have my own opinions, and there's no negativity there. I mean, it's just his opinion against mine. There's no confrontation. There's no negativity. I don't, I don't you know, become upset with his opinions. Um, it just expands your mind. When you, when you can put yourself in somebody else's shoes... Or somebody else, somebody else's um, side of the story, or side of the argument, or side of the debate. Uh, you become a better person. That's what makes great writers. Is people that can be, they can become that. Uh, so I mean, the channel is the channel is amazing, dude. And uh, Joe Rogan is funny. I really enjoy when Duncan Trussell's on. That's always uh, that's always a good show. <laughs> Um, and, uh, I just wanted to say, Joe, when are you coming to Texas? Uh, I live in the Dallas Fort Worth area and I'd love to see your stand up because when you told that dude to lick your, <laughs> lick the tartar sauce off your fucking pants, that was great. But, um, yeah, I just, I'm going to look for tickets anyway. All right. Well, Joe Rogan experience search. It has a, it has a. A picture of Joe Rogan, like a caricature, and there's a third eye. Uh, I don't know if there's any fake fucking channels out there, but it's a podcast, and then he cuts it down to little snippets of, uh, you know, the best of the week, and then there'll be other stories that he found interesting or funny or whoever edits his shit, and uh, they 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 put that out. So check him out, Joe Rogan Experience. I <laughs> I don't have any fucking subscribers yet, so hopefully. Uh, one day I will, and they'll see this fucking video and go check it out because, although not everybody's gonna be receptive to it, uh, there are intelligent people left out there. So, God bless you and your family, and have a great night.